All right, everybody. Um, I want to talk a little bit about a, ta- uh, a topic that comes up quite a bit in a lot of my instruction. Um, it's talking about angle of attack. And, you know, there's a lot on the sub- to, subject that you can read about. But what we want to start talking about is actually, you know, what does it mean to actually have a good angle of attack? And the first thing I want to talk about is when you're getting the ball on the ground. So uh, we got our golfer guy here got two shoes and some legs and you know we got the ball in our stance and the ball is the white line when the ball is on the ground one of the most important things is you got to realize that the angle of attack on a shot needs to be down now it doesn't have to be a lot down and actually as you get higher up in the game you you really want to minimize how much down but as you're starting to learn the game you need to start to see, okay, if this blue line is going to be the golf club, it needs to be approaching down into the ball, and then it's going to start to go back up. All right, so the swing really represents an arc that you're going to see the club start to work its way up. All right, so it's going to go down. You want to strike the ball when it's on its way down, and then it's going to start working its way back up. Again, the whole purpose is to actually get the club driving down under the ball. You're going to trap the ball a little bit under on the club, but it's to get the club and the center of gravity of the club driving down. Now, if we start to look at on a tee, this is where things get a little bit different on a tee. When you start to look at the tee, all right, we're going to have the same ball position here. And if we take the same angle of attack and the same swing, okay, the ball now, the club, it's the swing's going to look the same, but our swing is now going to start to curve up a little bit sooner to where we actually want to be swinging even on the ball or trying to swing the ball or sweep the ball off the tee or actually swing and hit the ball on the way up. And that's actually ideal where you start launching the ball higher. This is usually with the driver um, where you have very little loft on the club. But the biggest thing you want to start looking for is, you know, I see so many times people pop the ball up or with an iron on the tee, they start to hit the ball very high on the face and it really loses a lot of distance. And everybody thinks that, oh, I, I, you know, I went under it, right? And I got to, you know, or I hit it on the top, I got to swing more down and get to the ball, you know, things like that. Really random things where they don't understand that actually you're swinging too down on it you know, you got to start swinging up on the ball. So it's just the difference between two, you know, two types of shots. Again, the ball on the ground and the ball on the tee. You want to start thinking about your angle of attack, which is a very important yet sometimes overlooked piece of golf instruction.